Hello, I'm Dan Toppy and welcome back to another brand new Fortnite video. Today I wanted to talk about the pump action shotgun and the tactical shotgun and which one is the best one in the game. To work out which weapon is the best in the game and to work out which one is best for each different types of player styles, we need to look at the stats of the weapon to see what areas of the weapon are the best and what areas it isn't so good at. So starting off with accuracy, the tactical shotgun isn't very accurate, has a much wider spread than the pump action shotgun. Pump action shotgun shoots more of a slug type round, whereas a tactical shotgun shoots more of a buckshot. Meaning that when using a pump action shotgun, you need to be a lot more accurate than you do with a tactical shotgun to do the same amount of damage. This makes tactical shotgun a lot more reliable in most situations, just because you don't need to worry as much about your aim. Because if you do miss your shots, you can easily follow it up with another one with a tactical shotgun, because the fire rate on the tactical shotgun is a lot higher than it is on the pump action. With the tactical shotgun, you can shoot 1.5 rounds per second, but with the pump action shotgun, you can only shoot 0.7 rounds per second. This does make a massive difference and it's one of the reasons why I prefer the tactical shotgun over the pump action shotgun. Just because when you do miss those few shots it doesn't really matter because you can't follow them up so quickly. When you do miss a shot with a pump action shotgun it is a problem just because most of the weapons in the game have a much higher fire rate than it. And by missing that one shot your enemy automatically has an advantage over you. The damage on the two shotguns is also very different. The tactical shotgun does a lot less damage than the pump action shotgun. Per shot the tactical does around 67 to a normal body shot whereas the pump action shotgun does about 95 to a body shot. This means that the pump action shotgun has a much higher chance of getting a one shot kill if you do hit a headshot than a tactical shotgun does. Those damage values though are both for the uncommon versions of the weapons, so the green versions. So if you do pick up a purple or a blue version of a tactical shotgun, it will be doing more damage than the normal green version. Because of the higher fire rate, the tactical shotgun does have a higher damage per second than the pump action. The green tactical shotgun can do 100.5 damage on a one times multiplier, so that's on body shots, whereas the green pump has a much lower DPS at 66.5. This does mean that if you are using a pump action shotgun you do need to be aiming for those higher multiplier areas such as the head and the upper chest instead of the main lower body, because by doing this, this is where you will be getting those big hit points that you will sometimes see around 120-130, So when you do land the headshot with the pump action shotgun at very close range it is extremely damaging, whereas the tactical shotgun wouldn't be quite as damaging at close range but because you can get those shots off a lot faster it does make the damage per second a bit higher. So if you're a really confident player with really consistent and accurate aim you're probably better off using the pump action shotgun because you will be always hitting those high damaging shots and also going for those headshots which get you a lot more points than a normal body shot. An advantage to using the pump action shotgun over the tactical shotgun is that it's a bit better at range than the tactical shotgun. So if you do get caught with your pump action shotgun out at a range which is a bit further than you normally would with a shotgun you might be able to still do some damage to them. If you're more like me and your aim isn't always perfect as I do miss quite a few shots shots, you're going to want a more reliable, predictable gun which is the tactical shotgun. Because of the increased spread it makes it so much easier to hit shots in any situation and also because you have that increased fire rate it means you can easily get follow up shots off if you do miss your first one. When I am using a tactical shotgun I do sometimes die to those lucky one tap headshots from a pump action. This is pretty inevitable but I don't find that that one shot kill potential with the pump action shotgun makes it worth taking the pump action over the tactical. I'm not saying the pump action is a bad gun, I'm not saying that I don't like using it, but I'm saying for my style of play, I'd much prefer to use a tactical shotgun. It does take a lot more skill to use a tactical shotgun, but if you do have that skill, then it does definitely pay off. I just find that it's a lot easier and a lot more consistent to use a tactical when moving at high speed, especially because it's so easy to find purple and blue variants around the map at the moment. I think they might have increased the spawns of them, whereas green pumps aren't that easy to find, and now that double pumping has been taken out of the game, switching to another one to get another shot off a lot quicker means that your fire rate is extremely limited. But let me know what you think about the two shotguns in the game, which one you prefer, which one you think is the best. Do you prefer to have a high damaging gun that shoots slower or a more average damaging weapon that shoots a lot faster? When it comes to weapons like this, the playstyle of each individual player does have a massive impact on which one is the best one for you to take. So let me know if you agree with me on whether the playstyles do match up with the types of shotguns that I set. But that is everything for this video. If you have enjoyed it, please make sure you leave it a like, subscribe if you aren't already subscribed. Check out the playlist on the end card at the end of the video, especially if you want any help with any of the challenge week so far but thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video